Hey guys, Zach here, coming at you with another video. So fun fact, before I start this video, this jacket is actually a girl's jacket. Um, because they don't sell men's versions of this jacket. Um, I don't know what makes this a woman's jacket over a man's jacket, because I look just fine in it, it doesn't make me look girly. It's just apparently a female jacket. This is a size, like, extra, extra large, like 2X, meaning that I, I, I'm one big woman. So anyways, today I wanted to show off my Harry Potter Pop collection. You see the boxes in the background there. Um, the main reason I wanted to show them off is because I needed a video to make. And B, I'm very proud of my Harry... Shit. I'm very proud of my Harry Potter uh, Pop collection. There's a lot more that I want to get. Like the new Ramus Lupin and uh, Wormtail ones that came out. I definitely want those. Um, I still want Ginny Weasley, Neville, um, McGonagall, Hagrid. There's still quite a few that I want but I just haven't been able to get them. Um, I have a total of 15, uh, well, 16, really. Just one is in storage still from the whole moving thing, because uh, all these I got after the main move, but one I got before, and that's the original Harry Potter one, you know, the one everybody has. whoop de doo The rest of these ones are the actual interesting ones, so let's get started. Probably gonna start off with the first, like, it's Harry Potter. Um, it is the Triwizard Edition Harry. Sorry, the lighting is kind of shite. Um, but it's the Triwizard Tournament Edition of Harry. Next up, um, this is, it's gonna be in completely random order too, so I apologize if, like, you know, they're not in, like, release order or wave order. But this is Sirius Black. Oh, it's weird, like, the camera's on that side. Uh, this is Sirius Black. This is probably one of my favorites. It's the Dementor. Now, granted, Dementors are, like, one of my favorite things in Harry Potter in general. I love Dementors. Any Dementor merch I find... Like, I would buy in a heartbeat because I just love Dementors. I don't know why. <laughs> I really don't. They're my favorite creature. Um, they just are. But, um, I just, I just, I just, <laughs> I just love it. Probably another one of my favorites, um, Dobby the House Elf. I love this one because he's so cute. He's so little. Like, you see his eyes. I mean, his eyes are the normal size of every other pop, but for some reason it looks bigger because Dobby's head is so small and because he's so adorable. Next up is Draco Malfoy. Typical Hogwarts attire, Draco Malfoy. Nothing special here. Uh, this is the Yule Ball Hermione figure. I've wanted, I've looked at this figure for a while, but the only reason I got it is because it was in one of my loot crates, one of my Harry Potter loot crates. So that was very cool to get. Of course, you can't have Harry Potter without his villain, Voldemort. Um, this is Severus Snape. Pretty casual looking Severus Snape. This is the Michael Gambon portrayal of Albus Dumbledore. Because I believe they have both um, the Michael Gambon, uh, portrayal, and the Richard Harris portrayal, so that's pretty cool, um, I have Michael Gambon, and probably my three favorites, um, Dolores Umbridge, I don't know why, um, everyone hates Umbridge, I mean, everyone hates Umbridge for obvious reasons, but that's the thing, I love Umbridge for the reason that people hate her, I think she's a brilliant villain, um, because of the fact that she's just this little older woman, you know, she seems peaceful, her her office is filled with cats, it's it's pink, it's cute, but then like when you see her, like her like her actual character, and see her like unhinge after the events of Order of the Phoenix, you see her true self and she's like that's why I love her character so much. I don't love her character because of the character. I love it because oh, actually I do love it because of the character. Like, I don't love, like, you know, obviously everyone hates her because she's a villain, she's mean, she's awful, but I love this character because of, like, I, I don't know, it's weird. I, like, a lot of people are going to hate on me for loving on Bridge, but I, I can't help it. Mad-Eye Moody is next. I love this figure just because, like, the detail put into this one, because of the eye, like, I'm glad they did the blue eye as opposed to, like, just another, like, black guy, um... You know, the detail in the clothing. I know it's going to be hard to see because of the lighting. Actually, no, it's actually all right. You can kind of see it. Uh, of course, he has a staff and his, like, short wand because Mad-Eye Moody has a really short wand. Um, yeah, and um, I don't know how well you'll be able to see it because it's kind of a lighting thing. But this um, shoe has more of a shine to it than this one because that's his metallic foot because he lost a leg. Um, but, yeah, Mad-Eye Moody. And then lastly, this is probably my most uncommon figure. Um, it's Cedric Diggory. He was a Hot Topic exclusive. 
Um, but I ordered him off of Amazon because I wanted to. Um, so, yeah, Cedric Diggory. So, those are all my Harry Potter pop figures, but I do also have some Fantastic Beasts ones. Um, of course, we have to have Newt Scamander. Um, this is him holding the Alchemy Egg. Um, he has the wand there. Um, I love Newt Scamander's character. Um, I personally love his character more than I like Harry Potter's character. Um, because, you know, Harry Potter is just an angsty, emotional, hormonal teen. Whereas Newt is kind of a shyer, um, more. Like, he's more relatable to me, I guess, than Harry Potter is. Um, well, actually, I kind of have a mix of both of them, and if I'm going to be honest, but I just love, like, how ditzy kind of Newt Scamander is. Like, I don't know. I love it. And, of course, I, I love that a Hufflepuff gets a spotlight. Like, I'm not a Hufflepuff, but I, I'm in full support of a Hufflepuff getting a spotlight. And then, lastly, I'm going to show both of these in one go. They're both Nifflers. Um, I got both editions of the Niffler. The one that's just holding the coins in its little, like, kangaroo-like pouch, and then the one that's got the pocketbook. Uh, I, both uh, one of them I got in like a loot crate and the one of them I got um, in a store um, I love the Niffler <laughs> the Niffler is a freaking cute little bastard I love him uh, if I could own the Niffler I would it looks like a mixture of a platypus and uh, like a badger kind of like a platypus mixed with a honey badger something like that it's like that kind of mix um but yeah, I got, I got two Nifflers. I ain't gonna complain. And if there's any characters I think should be released that aren't released or haven't been announced, um, probably Trelawney, I think would make a really good pop because of all the intricacies of her. Um, uh, maybe Flitwick. Um, Grip Hook, because he's a goblin. That's something different. Uh, the Minister of Magic, maybe? Uh, you know, I'm kind of stretching it a little bit now, but I, there's so many characters it could still release. I'm just like a Death Eater, like a casual Death Eater, like, you know, in the, the get-up and all that. Um, Ollivander. Like, the list can go on and on about the characters it could release, and I would buy them all. Like, if I had the money, it's just about 10 bucks a piece, I would still buy them all. Like, I believe there'd be... <laughs> How many? 50? Don't quote me on that. 50 give or take Harry Potter Pops. I'd buy them all. That's 500 bucks, but well spent, right? I mean, shit, all of these are probably about 100. I'm about a fifth of the way there. I mean, damn. That's not even counting the uh, Fantastic Beasts ones. Um, because I think they, for Fantastic Beasts, I mean, it's too early to really give a lot of characters a pop. Uh, they should give Grindelwald one, though. I don't know why Grindelwald didn't get one. Um, but, you know, with the release of the next movie, he probably will. Um, yeah. So, that's it, guys. Um, that's it. Me talk. That's all I gotta say about my pops. I love them. I want to get more. I probably will get more once the Christmas season rolls around. Um, yeah. So, thank you guys so much for watching. Hope you enjoyed. Uh, until next time, see you guys in the next video.